There are enough security in place for a controversial speech at UConn that spiraled out of control. We showed you this mess. Security was beefed up Tuesday night. School officials tell us when chaos broke out, somebody grabbed a speech from a controversial right-wing speaker. News 8 investigator George Colley has UConn's response. UConn says if the university started to plan for extra security to be at the Lucian Wintrich speech as soon as the organizers notified them of the event last week. Spokeswoman Stephanie Reitz says there were a number of uniformed and non-uniformed officers present at the event. She says the school's been having ongoing discussions this year as to how to best secure events that could turn volatile. A large group of protesters shouted down the White House correspondent for the far right leaning the Gateway Pundit. At one point during the speech, a man and woman approached the podium yelling at Wintrich, the woman who Quinnebog Valley Community College confirms it's one of its employees, then grabs a hard copy of the speech while security just looks on. Wintrich then chased after the woman, grabbing her from behind in an effort to retrieve what he says was the only hard copy he had of his speech. Wintrich was arrested and charged with second degree breach of peace. Wintrich told me yesterday that he asked security several times to remove any protesters that were approaching the podium. The school says it is reviewing the protocols from the other night and is hoping to learn from it for any future events. UConn says the event was open to the general public, so there were not just students there. Wrights also points out that despite the chaos, there were no reported injuries, and the police are still investigating the matter, including the woman's actions. Wintrich told me that he is considering legal action against the school for lack of security. The UConn spokeswoman had no comment on that. George Colley, News 8.